Hey guys, I got a new video for you today, and this is going to be a look at a new bag that I just received from Black Scorpion Outdoor Gear. This is their Punisher Response Bag. Now this bag is designed to be able to hold any firearms, ammunition, and accessories that you might need. I could easily see this bag sitting inside of my safe, completely loaded out with all those things that I just mentioned, uh, and just uh, you know accessible at any time that I might need it. Now, being the community that we are, we always try and repurpose a gear, so I could easily see this as an EDC bag as well. It's got more than enough pockets and more than enough areas to be able to add other um, accessories to it that you can easily fit that uh, particular role. I would also be able to see this as a really good range bag. Uh, it's nice and light, so whenever you stuff it with all your ammunition and accessories, uh, you're able to uh, carry it really comfortably to the range. Uh, it goes over one shoulder and you're good to go. So the bag itself is a uh, 1000D nylon, which again makes it lightweight, uh, but it's also very resistant to whatever um, you know, task you're going to put it through. All the zippers are YKK zippers and all the buckles are UTX Duraflex buckles. Now what I've done is I've actually outfitted it with uh, some of the normal things that you would see in a response bag like your, uh, your mags and your ammunition and things like that. But I've also thrown in some EDC items so you guys can see um, the dual role that the bag can play. On the outside of the bag, in the front, you have these three pockets, which are originally designed to hold uh, AR-15 style mags. So as you guys can see here, I have two 30 round mags, which uh, are very nice and snug in there. What I've done is I've tucked the flap in the back so they're easily accessible. Um, it has some elastic on the side which allows it to flex in and out so whenever you're not using it you can put the flap back down and it's not going to be sticking out. On this one right here which has the Black Scorpion uh, logo on it, I have a 20 round magazine which fits nice and flush inside of the pocket and it has more than enough room to fit another 20 round mag in there. Now because you have the, the long strip of Velcro right here, you're actually able to Velcro it nice and tight down. So since it only has the one mag in there, you know, the, the flap is not going to be flapping around. Now on the other side, you do get a uh, loop of Velcro on there so you can put your morale patches. As you guys can see, I have my Oakley tab there. And then inside, what I've done is I've added some EDC items. So I have a spare knife, a spare flashlight, and a multi-tool. Uh, inside of its carrier right there and again closes nice and snug you do get pockets on either side of the bag um, this one right here uh, has uh, three rows of molly so you can attach uh, extra pockets or extra um, carriers or anything like that you might want on there and then when you open up the zipper the zipper goes down a little bit more than halfway so it gives you enough room to be able to bring the flap down to access that pocket pretty easily. So you guys can see in there I have three Glock mags and there's definitely more than enough room to fit at least three more Glock mags in there. So it'll definitely fit whatever it is that you would want to put into that pocket. Now on the other side, like I mentioned already, you have a similar pocket again with the three rows of molly and inside of that one I have just some regular EDC items. So a poncho, a blanket, uh, some wet wipes and things like that. Now one of the things that I like about this bag is the zipper for the main compartment here. Normally you would find in these tile bags that the zipper either zips one way or the other. This one actually has two so you're able to either keep them in the middle and zip it open like that or you're able to put it to one side or to the other just depending on what your preference is. So I'll go ahead and open that up and inside there I just have a couple items just so you can see um, just how it's laid out. I have a more knife. I have this bag that has a, it's kind of like a toiletry kit bag. And then one of the intended purposes, which is to carry ammunition. I just have uh, two different size boxes of 9mm ammo in there. And there's definitely more than enough room to fit anything else that you might need to fit in there. In the back of the, of the center compartment, you do have three rows of molly that run from one end of the compartment to the other. So again, you're able to put in uh, any other type of um, pouches or anything like that that you might want. Or as you guys can see here, I have it um, holding a Sharpie and a glow stick. So, you know, you have more than enough room to put extra pouches in there if you wanna further organize the inside of the main compartment. Now towards the back, you have a, what some people would call a CCW pocket or a concealed um, carry pocket in there. Again, it, it has the zipper on there. You open it up and inside, so you guys can see for size reference, I have my Smith & Wesson Governor. So definitely it's a 
you guys know the size of the governor that's a pretty big gun so so you guys can see it fits any type of firearm for the most part uh, really nice and snug and really easy easily accessible onto the strap the strap has this uh, padding on there which you are able to remove it if you want to but it makes carrying the bag a lot more comfortable and then uh, you have the buckle right here which if you do need to unbuckle it to be able to you know put this around maybe another bag or maybe around a car seat or something like that you're able to do that and it does have an hk style clip right here so you can hang keys or hang any other um you know any other uh, accessories that you might want to and in the back it has this uh arrow padding which actually allows it for uh, uh it's anti-abrasion arrow padding so you know as it's rubbing up against your body you know it's not gonna you know ca cause the bag to come undone or you know put any uh any type of uh rubbing against your clothing or anything like that and it allows for breathability of the bag itself and then one last feature is it does have this loop right here which you're able to put through your belt if you want to keep a more secure fit uh, of the bag onto your body so there it is this is the punisher response bag from black scorpion outdoor gear definitely it's a bag that has a uh, it's multi-faceted. You're able to use it for a lot of different things, not just at intended purposes, as you guys saw here. Uh, great EDC bag, great range bag, or great response bag. So let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.